Hello and welcome to another video of this Power BI Do It Yourself Tutorials. In this video, we're going to explore what is in the PBIX file, looking under the hood. Now, before we begin, um, you have created several PBIX files. Now, let's see what's under the hood. What's exactly is PBIX, right? I mean, that was the curiosity. And then uh, I looked up to this website, uh, formu.com, and the link is given here. I'm going to copy and paste the link in, um, in my uh, video description section of, the, uh, of this video. So it tells you how and what is under, is in the PBIX. And I read this blog. You should also go and read this blog up. This is very good. All right, so this is disclaimer. I read this blog, understood what it is, and that's how I'm showing it to all of you. So rename the PBIX file as zip and then unzip the file and see the contents. So this is the SUDA template. I'm going to copy, make a copy of it. Do not do this if you do not have any idea or if it's a production report, not your report, do not try that at home. So right click, rename, uh, just make it a zip file and then it will be a zip. Yes, I want to uh, have a zip file and then unzip it. Now, I have already unzipped this file and kept it here. This is what is inside the PBIX file. Now, uh, let me show you or let me tell you what these mean. So report, content types, data mashup, data model, diagram state, metadata, security bindings, settings, and versions. So the report folder is the layout of the Power BI visual reports. Uh, content types, .xml is having the content structure of this folder in XML format. Data mashup includes everything about the Power Query, M script, structure of queries, parameters, and functions. Data model includes the data in the model, which is the in a compressed format. Diagram state stores the table and matrix, matrix information. Metadata contains all label names. You see the, the, the visuals we create, they all have GUIDs and it stores all the GUIDs and all the labels. Security bindings, it's a low level, low, row level security configuration in Power BI stored in binary format. Uh, settings, Power BI settings menu, and then version of the file. So this is what it contains in the PBIX. And this is just out of curiosity, uh, we figured it out. But I mean, of, of course, I read it on the website and then looked at it myself. So hands-on, copy and paste one of your PBIX file and rename the extension. Now explore the files. Thank you for watching.